I know it has been a super long time since I've posted anything, but I'm back kind of. Um, since I've smashed a rock on my knee in New Zealand, I kind of forcefully had to take a break of cycling. I did a lot of work now here, I learned more things about videography and photography since this was my job now, but in order to figure out if my knee is actually still working and if I could continue cycling, I did one test ride from Germany over the Alps to Italy and my knee was completely fine on this ride. I needed to figure out actually if my knee works on longer distances. So I think this ride was too short. So then I went to Greece. <music> So today is the 1st of November and we are just out of Thessaloniki. We've got no tent this time, but we've got shitloads of cameras. Anyways, this is Christoph, this is a friend, which I know since I'm probably four or five years old. No, kindergarten, since kindergarten time. Our plan is to cycle from Thessaloniki to Athens and to take some awesome pictures. Let's Whoa. tackle the mission. <laughs> That looks like a fun way to cross the river. Yep. Oh. <laughs> <Shit>. <laughs> oh. I think this is actually the way where we have to cross. It's not too deep, so it should be totally fine. Chris have got wet feet anyways by now. I think it's some kind of a spot to watch birds, but the entrance is a little bit challenging. Just be careful here and here. Oh, yeah. Sit some. Oh god, shit! <laughs> Actually, we were hoping to have a nice view, but unfortunately, it's okay. Not too amazing though. No. Those ones are very, very wobbly. <laughs> and be careful, there is a nail looking up straight. Do you see it? Okay, here. Yeah. yeah, exactly under your feet. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> cool. That was a nice challenge. Anyways, we keep going this way and there will be an autobahn and we follow it on the left side. And since Krista fell into the water, he decided to cycle barefoot and in order to protect his feet, he just wrapped around his socks. After cycling for a while on this dusty road, we kind of discovered some abandoned old factory. Let's have a look. So apparently they used to sell tiles from here. Obviously not anymore. Okay. Okay. Wow. 
and this road is like super dusty. So it's about half past six and it's dark and we are desperately trying to find a spot for the night but tricky because everything is literally wet. I think Greece definitely has a quite big problem with rubbish. So I think we found by now a pretty good spot. It's a little bit weird here but actually not too bad. <laughs> so it's a new day and it's raining we just wait until it stops it's supposed to stop like 2 p.m and we just hope that's true okay it works yeah great job nice <laughs> 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 so we're slowly getting ready to leave. Actually, it's still kind of raining, but it gets kind of more bright. <laughs> I'm sounding like a train. <laughs> leaking. Terrible street. Yeah, terrible. On the map there is supposed to be a bridge. It looks like a bridge but we are not sure how much this bridge is usable. It looks actually pretty good. Just a little bit dangerous but should be fine. We've got no other choice, I think. I mean, we can do like a long detour, but I think it's it's kind of safe if you are careful. Let's do it. So it's working out kind of well, slow, but steady. Takes a lot of time though, but this bridge is huge. So we finally reached the other side and we can continue. So we spotted a turtle. So it's a hole here and the turtle dropped inside so we're not sure if she's still alive or not. But if so we could rescue her and get her out again. Okay, okay come on the super turtle. Turtle show us spot. Yeah. Brand new. Fresh again. Ich glaube, hier ist wieder Platz. Die Katze auch Wasser von den Tieren. So, good morning. We did another night here in Greece, and we had a really beautiful setup for the night. So, this is where we slept. Awesome. All right, let's go. So we are really trying to find a spot to camp, but there are so many dogs here around and yeah, we don't oh, know. What a sound. Let's see. It would be great actually to sleep on top of these little hills so we could have a nice view onto the Olymp mountain which is just behind but I'm not too sure if there is actually a road but it looks so beautiful yeah straight here yeah
maybe, maybe here. Just remove this stuff and then just sleep here. By the way, Hayden, I still have the Leatherman. Still working, as you can see. Oh. <laughs> I think Christoph has so muscles. <lacht> ich muss hier mal die Scheiße vom Draht klopfen. <lacht> We take a lot of breaks and do random things like now a stone throwing competition. So over there is this tree and we're wondering if we could actually throw all the way until there. But we need to find the perfect stone. Ah, ich bin eher so, ne? Okay. Und dann machst du den Stemmschritt. Rechts dann vor, Arm hoch. Ja. Ah, Alter, halt die Röse, ey. <lacht> dann. Oh, nee. Das war ja richtig blöd. Okay. <laughs> Alter, der ist voll weggedreht. So we just arrived here at this spot which is like really beautiful. Over there should be the Olymp behind the mountains, uh, behind the clouds. And yeah, really nice with the colors from the trees. Very beautiful. Very few dogs around but they're all very friendly. It's a really nice path actually going up to here and it looks beautiful. We can't really continue because here the road is blocked or the road, the path. So maybe we just cross the river but it's really hard to guess how deep it is. He wants to try it. So we washed our legs. But it's very cold, really cold, really beautiful. So eventually we made it back to the bikes and pitched our hammocks between the trees and made a little bonfire and cooked a really nice lentils dish. It's a new morning and we slept here at this amazingly beautiful riverbed kind of. We pitched the hammocks here, really good. and. Now we're packing up and keep moving towards west. Good morning! Oh fuck, that's not good. Yeah. yeah, that's a very common trick. Just pretend you pick up something and most dogs in the Balkans would think, oh, he's gonna throw something, so it's gonna hurt, so I run away. So let's tackle this uphill. We have to follow the road on the right side. Oh. 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 I need a 
battery. Uh, uh, uh. What a hard trip. Yeah. That's just the beginning. <laughs> Fuck, <laughs> shut up. So slowly it's getting dark. So we need to find a spot for the night. But there will be a village in like one kilometer from here. And we need to fill up our water. And it's getting chilly and very humid. So eventually we found finally water here in this little village. And also managed to find a spot to sleep. So we found a soccer field. And it's the best we can find. We even got a door so we can close and be protected from the dogs even have some shelter so it's like perfect so this episode comes to an end now and yeah see you soon next one is coming stay tuned peace out and bye bye